better way to start off this video than with the call to prayer from the blue mosque itself um doing almost like a tag team job with the place opposite which i think is the palace museum but anyway this is the blue mosque um it's you know the Blue Mosque, it is famous. And we were lucky enough to stay just like a 10, 15 minute walk away from this. However, every single morning we could hear this, the call to prayer at six in the morning, which is fine. It was kind of cool really. Um, but yeah, here it is. Now, it looks so impressive from the outside. However, on the inside at the moment, there is a lot of work being done. So while it is an incredible space, we didn't actually get to see that much of it. So you can see here literally everything we saw. Um, the rest of it was covered up. It had scaffolding. Um, yeah, the outside is incredible. Um, and you, if you have the time, go inside. There are some queues to get in. But yeah, it's the Blue Mosque. What more can I really say? Um, however, down the road, this we found a bit more interesting because it wasn't so kind of covered up and like being renovated. This is the Basilica Cistern. So this is where the water um, was transported to the palace, if I remember correctly. Now, when you go in, it is pitch black. It is wet. It is slippery. So be careful if you are going in there um, and it's all steps as well so just to throw that out there um, as well for anyone who has like mobility issues please be careful because it is going to be slippy and it is all steps but it is beautiful while I couldn't take much video down there because it was pitch black a lot of the pictures I managed to take came out pretty well uh, a little bit fuzzy in places but it's beautiful that is the crying uh, pillar, which was put up for basically all the people who died building it. Um, and it's the only pillar apparently that's constantly wet. And there are also two Medusa heads, um, which are at the bottom of pillars. It's an incredible place. So while I've just given you a tiny, tiny view of it here, definitely go see it if you find yourself in Istanbul. So thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and I will see you next time.